What's up guys and welcome to another video and let's get ready to wake up and react to another episode of Hunter Hunter season 1 episode 6. Not going to do a super long intro because I don't want to and like I said for Patreon I'm recording these back to back for YouTube. I'm not but I don't want to record an intro later. Pretty much clown guy or uh, his co's fucking people up spared Gone and Leorio because he seem deems them worthy of becoming hunters. The people he doesn't deem worthy deserve to be killed off. <laughs> and uh, they all reached the end of the like the run in the Swindler's Swamp. So now we have to see what the next step is. Oh, and Gone likes the rush he feels from almost dying. He's curious about that feeling. It's the first time he's felt it, so it's it's new, so it's exciting. I don't know. If he really does like that feeling, that adrenaline rush of almost dying or the thrill of a fight... I know the thrill of a fight, okay, oh, I don't know, that's still kind of weird, but I don't know how far he's going to take that. I mean, some of you were calling him a psychopath, so I could kind of see that now if he really does enjoy almost dying that much. Like, not dying, but the, the fear of almost dying. He seemed to really like that. I don't know, it was weird, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So, I like how the chairman kind of comes in and he's like, alright, listen here, bitch. Now, your exam was way too extreme. It has to taste good, and it has to be to your standards when your standards are the freaking highest ever and only some top-notch gourmet chefs and, like, only a handful or a few, I think he said, the uh, her partner said, uh, can even satisfy your palate, and you expect them to? That's bullshit. I like that. But he didn't even have to say anything. He's like, what the fuck is that? That's a mosquito. Oh, no, 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 I don't want that in my room. Ooh, where did it go? <sighs> I don't want that in here. It's gonna bite me. I don't know. Maybe it'll stay up there while I'm recording and I can get it when I'm done, but... Um, all he had to do, this chairman, all he had to do was show up. He showed up and he's like, listen here now. You really think that that's acceptable? Don't you think you're taking things a bit far? And she's just like... Oh, yeah, yeah, I just get, I get carried away when it's relating to food, you know me. <laughs> well, she didn't do it how I did it, but I just find that hilarious. As soon as he shows up, she checks herself. He didn't even need to say anything. Oh, great. Um, but then they have to go get the eggs, and some have, I think more than half of them dropped out. And then I feel bad. Some of them clearly just died. They just jumped to their fucking death. And they just... It, <laughs> gloss over it like oh well no comment those two yeah okay sorry i i don't like bugs that's really fucking gross to me so anyway uh so yeah some of them just died and they glossed over that uh and then gone's instincts really come in handy a lot of the time like being able to smell the pigs being able to figure out like he could smell the wind like when it's going to come um so that they didn't die when they jumped down uh and then or knowing the perfect time to jump or let go not jump uh and then what else did he do so far being able to tell those animals apart in a couple episodes ago um like the man and the woman um and then what else did he do same thing on the boat with the ship Find, being able to find Leorio with his sense of smell, it seems like, is the strongest thing that he has. And it's the most useful. I don't know about his sense of, like, his eyesight or his hearing. I don't know how good those are, but... Because I don't know if taste is really all that... Imp oh, yeah, his t sense of... His taste is great. He's like, ah! I remember when he spit the drink out, too. That really helped them. Mm, this doesn't taste good. I think it's expired. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm, I'm talking too much about everything, just listing everything, but... Time and time again, he really comes in clutch for them and saves them and helps them get past this next phase of the hunter's exam. And I don't think any of them, well, maybe Killua, but I don't think Leorio or Kurapika would have gotten this far without Gon. Kurapika, I don't think he would have been able to get out of that, I don't know what you call it, what are they, that abyss, you want to call it this ridge, I don't know what you call it, but. He, he wouldn't have known when to drop, so, I mean, I don't know. 
Maybe he he has some powers or skills that I'm not aware of yet that would have helped him in that situation, but so far he hasn't shown any, so I don't know. No, I don't really think there's really much else to comment on. Um, I have no idea what the next part's going to be, but overall, like that last line, yeah, you do need to, I think, respect each and every hunter's, or each and every type of hunter there is. Because, just because maybe her thing is gourmet cooking, but that doesn't mean that she doesn't have to work as hard for what she does or that it's not as dangerous. She said that. She said we do these dangerous things to make this great food. Okay, I can respect that. But I, I just was upset that she was holding them to a way higher standard than she should have been because they're not gourmet chefs. You shouldn't be holding them to that standard. That was unfair. Um, and those are not... Those skills are maybe not necessary for the type of hunter that they want to be. Like, being able to cook something to your standards, your perfection, I mean, or your idea of perfection, I mean, that doesn't help them. How they cook, or how they kill the animal or get it, that was more important, I think, than the way they cooked it. So, when she changed it, and she changed it to, like, the method and showing how dangerous it is, that I respected more. Um, but yeah, anyway, uh, I don't know what else to say. I think that's about it. So remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch that on my Patreon. Other than that, I'm going to get out of here, guys, and I will catch you in the next reaction.